In the 2030s, humans will go to the red planet for the first time. To accomplish this in a sustainable, affordable, and long-lasting way, an in-situ resource utilization architecture is needed. In recent years, water ice below the Martian surface has been detected, creating a promising opportunity for water-based ISRU architectures for production of propellants and other resources. Mapper responds to this calling by providing a mission concept that could support a large-scale production and storage of liquid methane and liquid oxygen, as well as water and other byproducts. First, a global survey will be conducted with an EMO, obtaining a global assessment of the water ice reserves on Mars. Then, a local survey will be conducted with Science Flex, which will obtain important surface information. Flex is a lunar and Martian rover being actively developed by Venturi Astrolab. In 2036, the ISRU will land and begin operations shortly thereafter. The ISRU system and all the payloads in the mission will be transported by a fleet of flex rovers. To extract the water, a Rotwell system will be employed. The system will reach the water ice layer for melting and extraction. Then, it will be transported to the ISRU plants, where it will be processed into liquid methane and liquid oxygen. The total production per year is over 50 metric tons of propellant surplus of liquid oxygen and byproduct water. This production extended to 5 years results in a total storage volume of 700 cubic meters. The storage of said production will consist of the inflatable ellipsoidal propellant tank from thin red line aerospace, which provides substantial mass and volume reduction due to being collapsible and lightweight. Mapper is being optimized to reduce mass, volume, cost and complexity in all aspects of the mission so that it can truly be a feasible solution to the challenge presented in Theme 3 of NASA Rascal 2022.